All right. myself. Hi. <laughs> All right. We've got Oob versus Legit Condition. We saw this. Wait. Yes, we already saw this matchup with Oob uh, and Jag. So let's see how this goes. Game one on Ethereal Gates. I think Legit Condition might be a little bit different. A little bit. <laughs> um, however, now maybe that, not. Maybe not. <laughs> now that it, Jack didn't really consume the smoke all that much either, so maybe their playstyles are a little, are pretty similar. Uh, legit condition. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, is a, a very good player. So like, this could must might be a little different. You're right from who versus Jack. But we're gonna see. Wait, Edelis is still a bear. What just happened there? <laughs> went through his fair. It didn't look like he had fair armor. He did. He did. He did? Because I didn't see the fair come out at all. Interesting. But legit condition, the theme of this night has kind of been these unfortunate, these weird SDs. He kind of he's trying to recover and he just falls down and dies. I don't know what's going on with him there. That was happening versus Ragu, too. Yes. <gasps> That's the difference. Ah. There it is. I feel like that could have been. Well, he died anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that fairy punish could have been a little bit more. Um, <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure Cake would do a spike there in the back area there instead. Forsberg is such a weird character. I could never play Forsberg. What do you think? Do you think um, Cake Assault is right in saying that Forsberg is the worst character by far? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> it's down there. Bottom half of the cast, at least. I see that. Hold my breath every time he gets hit. This is last talk. Wow. Yeah, dude. Ooh. Le legit condition. Even though he had that SD, uh, so even right now. Almost uh, stopped for being alive. <laughs> I really wanted him to be the clone. I really wanted him to yeah. be the clone there. <laughs> 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 Is that upper gonna take it? That might be it. That might be oh, right now. He, he nicked him. He nicked him. No, he nicked him again. No, he didn't do anything there. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. He doesn't, he doesn't get hit by the Abby. Oh, man. That was a nail biter right there. That was anyone's game. But Oob clutched it out. Let's go, Oob. Taking game one yeah. against legit condition. Nice. Legit Polar condition. Bear, Edelis. Um, Oob now, getting counterpicked. Yes, to three top on. Legit condition likes this stage. I think. I think this is a comfort pick for him because he takes me to the stage all the time. Yeah, I also saw uh, in the last match that had Oob in it, he got counterpicked here as well, so he didn't ban it again. Um, so apparently he doesn't mind the stage that much. Yeah, I mean he won. Oh. <laughs> oh, what was that? Ooh, gotta DI those in, dude. Um, but yeah, I mean, he won on that this stage last time, but this could, again, this could be very different. Legit condition is a different player from Jack, as we're seeing right now. <laughs> yeah, he's getting a lot of damage off these openings. Atlas just can't really get back down to the ground on this stage and really, like, get his footing. Yeah. And that's, like, why I don't like it. I mean, it's so, like... I feel like Ford Burn, on this stage, he can just apply pressure so much easier. And that, I mean, normally, like you were, you were saying earlier, that he, it's probably better to play defensive, but in this case, with such a small stage, um, that'll, it allows him to put the pressure on. That's really shining right now. For yeah. 
how much like, you just you, you don't have enough room. Like, yeah. anywhere you go to try and, like, whiff punish is covered by a platform. Mm -hmm. So, like, you actually can't make Forest Burn whiff an aerial at your feet. You just don't have enough room. Yeah. Oh, he opts for the clone instead of parrying, but, I mean, he gets him off stage anyway. There's the parry, yep. This might be a quick two stock fight, which in condition. Unless he SDs right here, <laughs> for some reason, like he has been. Or Oob take advantage of this edge guard. Ooh, nice skip nice. back on stage. I actually really liked how he used clone in there, and it, act it put smoke out after the icicles. Because he got broken. Oh, what a dang ace. So, I think another thing that might be good for Forsburn on this stage, too, as I'm watching this, is um, Oob's having a little bit harder a time throwing those icicles off stage because of those platforms, too. Correct me if I'm wrong on that. Yeah, the whole stage is safe, pretty much. Yeah. Um, but even off stage, if he's trying to throw out um, these icicles. It seems like he's, he's ha he was having a little trouble getting off stage to get rid of that smoke. Yeah, the, the platforms being so close to the edge can actually mm -hmm. like block some certain angles that are really useful to have as yeah. well. Especially with that, that higher platform kind of limits where you can throw icicles. Anyway, legit condition, good stuff. That's a tough matchup. He takes game two. Going on to game three, Jules Veil. Vale. So, as an Edelus player, I've seen a lot of Edeluses take me to this stage. What do you think about it? I don't like it. I, I just don't like it. Um, the the platform is bad for Edelus. What's that? <laughs> um, so it's either it's it's always on one side of the stage, messing up your edge guard on that side of the stage, yeah. and then if you're on the other side of the stage. It's not. It's not doing anything. It's yeah. like, and you'd like to have a platform in a lot of situations. So, like, they're both like the bad side of the coin, you know. Yeah. But just kind of slightly different. So, what do you think if? And this is kind of like ideas. Wow. Sorry, Uber's is just running away with this game, though. Um, but do you think it would be a better stage? Oh my gosh, Uber's is just running away with this game. Um. Sorry, but if the platform didn't stay on the side as, as long as it does, what would you like do? move more frequently? Yeah, I still wouldn't like it because it's still like one of the things is it's moving, so like it's like inconsistent. Because I feel like with the platform being on the side for so long, it's almost like a, it's basically like a mini FD almost, and I I thought that stage was pretty good for Edelus. Wow. Yeah. Ooh, just running through legit condition on that stage. You said you don't like that stage, but geez, that was wow. <laughs> Dang, I've never seen Ooh play that well, honestly. I've ne I've I've been playing him for a couple years now, and I've dang, that was some good play by Ooh. Yeah, definitely. So Game four on Fire Capital. So Pitnorm countered me, counterpicked me to this stage. I'm gonna ask you again. What do you think about it? As a From player? in the, I can see in the working matchup. I'm not a fan of it in the four zone matchup because of the plot drop. Yeah, plot drop. It, it covers the whole stage. <laughs> Um, also with how I've been using platforms recently, it's even worse. Because I like to kind of control, like, aerial space. Yeah. And you just can't do that on this stage because you can't control the whole platform. It's too big. I feel like, um... And again, this is, this is just for Orkane matchup, like you were saying, but... When I was playing against Pit, he was using platform that drops against me pretty well. Um, and... You kind of cover that Dacus. Just covers that platform so well. Ooh, 
get some threes. Mm. I don't know what uh, Legit was thinking throwing out that hop smash when he was so far away. Maybe I guess he thought he was going to drift over and try and down special or something, but he... No. I just got him with that freeze. And now Oob has a lead. If he can get him off stage and get armor, this would be... A, I mean, this would be really good for Oob. Yeah, I've actually seen Oob throw out a couple of early air dodges in his recovery. It'd be really, really nice to see that uh, abused. <laughs> Legit can just take that first stock, but he's at 74%. That's a considerable lead for Oob. Ooh. Is that gonna take it? Nope, just barely. Especially as that was. Good DI by Legit Commission with that up smash. Oh, on stage. Oh! I feel like that clone was saved it. But Oob cleans up the stock now. How did that freeze? <laughs> It looked like he was... he wasn't on the platform completely. Ooh. A stock is not a lead. It is not. But also, Atlas is really tanky. <laughs> 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 You're definitely right on that. <laughs> oh, I don't know what was that, what that was, but oh, well, as the a little bit and it ended out. Could he? <laughs> did he? He had his resources. He had his air dodge, his jump, right? It uh, looked like it. <laughs> that whatever. Either way, good stuff to Oob. That's a pretty good win for Oob on legit condition. Not many people can say that they have wins on him, so. Good stuff to Oob. Taken out, that was losers, right? So yeah, that was technically a uh, fifth seed beating second seed. Yeah, it was. Wow, that's a pretty big upset. Good job. Let's go. Let's go, Oob. So we've got.